What to next? Hmm. We've completed our goal again. That's the king's cue. His royal highness, the king. <laughs> ah, he's here. The bird who was blowing up the garden just fell down a hole and disappeared. Though there are a lot of holes holes in the garden now. What the hell happened whoa, to his whoa. face? Whoa, okay, green with envy. <laughs> okay. All right, Van Gogh, please. <laughs> <laughs> the king is relieved. People who disturb the peace are too scary. Huh? What just happened to the king's head? Did I imagine that? <laughs> it is time for the king's reward. Please accept the king's jewel. That's my left bollock. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, it's so balls. pretty <laughs> and blue. What's it called? Lapis Lazuli. He really does know everything. The king said, please listen to the king's next request. How long is this fucking story? I don't know. Really Fire away, Highness. Don't you think you should word yourself more carefully, Mr. Insulatus? Since you're getting to play the heroine for once. Should I? Play the heroine? I feel like I'm on heroine. <laughs> the king is my troubled. <laughs> my royal heroine is gone. It looks like it might rain. <laughs> rain? Yeah, rain acid. Have you considered an umbrella, sir? It has never rained here since this kingdom was created. <laughs> but there are dark clouds gathering on the summit <laughs> of Mount Pudding. Mount Pudding? I know who will meet there already. I'm putting a tall, tall mountain. The clouds at its peak might slip off and slide down and come to King's Palace. <laughs> this is getting grosser and grosser. And will He's it be a problem if the palace gets <laughs> wet? It looks dirty enough. It'll probably be just fine in a storm. Never mind a little rain. I don't know about well, that. trouble. If the king's palace gets wet. Ooh. <laughs> he had another head again just now, didn't he? <laughs> Pardon? But he looks normal now, I think. It must have been my imagination. Why would you start crying just because it's raining? Oh my god, why must I yawn so much? The heroine in a J-pop song or a shoujo manga might do something like that. Maybe the king is a delicate maiden at heart. Don't worry, your highness. I will protect your fragile heart from the cruel weather. To Mount Pudding! After a long and perilous journey over valley and mountain, hill and dale, through dungeons deep and caverns old, the Geki and I arrive at Mount Pudding. Wow. Yeah, Holy it looks yummy. delicious. It, I could murder a cream caramel right now. It looks a little bit like um the little marshmallow things chopped in half and that's just blood. <laughs> well, that's awfully grim. <laughs> yes. But I'm not wrong. What an image. Ooh. It is even more pudding than that name had me led me to imagine. Looking at it, it... Well... I really can't think of any, any name other than Mount Pudding. Oh, oh that's you. Me. Calm down, Sam. Going berserk now won't fix anything. Um. Oh, oh my okay. god. I'm a nun. Nice get <laughs> I need to make sure one nun makes sure the other nun don't get none. All what right. up with that cross, though? <laughs> yeah. Looks like Which it's wearing one's... a dress. Okay. But it's oh, not. Concern. That's actually Mount Pudding, I think, on the cross. <laughs> oh, I thought uh, that was like a... <laughs> uh, who's seeing this? I think you. Okasan, I knew we'd see him here. No, I think it was the narrator. I thought Okasan would be here, but I hadn't quite expected you, Ryuta. Oh, hello, Dark Knight. <laughs> so you're here too, and... Nageki? So it would seem. I see. I guess you two are together even in this dreamland. We arrived on the same train. 
We're a dynamic duo on a quest for the king. <laughs> what about you? I'm dressed as a nun. Guess I'm a votaress of pudding. <laughs> okay. okay. And the role comes with a new costume. This time he gets to be a nun. N nice. So that means Okasan is... <laughs> the guardian deity of Mount Pudding. Good. Incidentally, what does he need those things on his back for? <laughs> yeah, he's got four wings. He's like <laughs> safer, safer Sephiroth. He's like... My God's supposed to be calm and composed. Wait, weef? What? Oh, okay, Weather. it loaded. Never, never so, mind. It just, it just loaded part of the text. Oh. Like, yeah, weef. <laughs> yes, weef. Weather usually changes quickly in the mountains. So if we wait, it should be clear again eventually. Sounds like the rain would be a problem for you too, Okasan. The king said rain has never fallen here, so there must be something behind it. It might not go away even if we wait. <sighs> I keep yawning! It's so bad! You're never gonna get rid of it of rain clouds by flapping at them, San. And if the clouds get blown down the mountain, the king will be sad. We need to think of another way. The clouds are coming from the summit. Let's climb the mountain and see what's up there, Nageki. Alright. Oh man. Ah, <laughs> oh, that yeah. was more of a climb than I'd expected. Oh, I never realized pudding was this hard to cl climb up. I suppose it is very slippery. You doing okay, Nageki? You didn't get tired. Yeah, not at all. I flew. This... This is the true separator of birds and men. <laughs> well, we're at the top. <laughs> yep. And there's something suspicious right over there. What Holy the hell? moly. Um... It's like I'm in an Unagami clan. Oh, is that that Aunt Manga thing they mentioned it's gonna spoil? Yeah. So this is just gonna spoil the manga here, no point for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> they could have used any other analogy, but they were like, no, we're gonna fucking spoil this for people. <laughs> Nageki, what do we do? This isn't a fairy tale, it's a murder mystery. It's a kiyoki, it's a kiyoki kiyoki. <laughs> nice. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> the corpse upside down in the water was a diversion by the real culprit. People get it mixed up all the time. But in Ugami Sukiyoki, you. Oh, I can't nice. say that. <laughs> Sukiyoki. Just think of kek as in top kek. <laughs> Sukiyoki. Su top kekiyo. Wasn't the man in the white mask or the corpse in the water? So this is what the spoiler warning was for. But even with a warning, it's bad f form to go telling people the answers to puzzles and mysteries. The Geki, don't do that. Anyway, if he stays stuck in the caramel for too long, he'll suffocate. <laughs> Let's help him. Right, you take one leg, I'll take the other. <laughs> I know. My... Go for it. Why am I always the stupid character? <laughs> I'm the manager. You... <laughs> You're the Dr. The Bird. He's like the best character. <laughs> oh, I can. I... But all my voices are the same. Could you do it like muffled? Because he has got like. Oh, bro... Okay, I'll get something. Oh, I'm really gonna lose. Still, Alan Rickman. Thank you. <laughs> wow, he's covered in caramel. Why is it he's brown? He's covered in cum. <laughs> He's covered in shit. He's, he's <laughs> like a walking ant trap. Um, we've been bumping into people who were at the observation so far, so, uh... You're Mr. Nanaki, right? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, we found him. Yeah. <laughs> Nemo? So your name is... Nemo. <laughs> You can't even fucking understand. <laughs> Should there at least be some English in this? Yes. <laughs> Someone think I might cry. Hey, Nageki. Don't you think the rain's getting a little heavier? Definitely. And more clouds are gathering. Oh, what should I look? 
I think I dropped it in the swamp. And look, and I look, and I don't find it. And now I feel sad. The sky sheds tears for you, Mr. Nemo. Damn fucking street. <laughs> How poetic. Well, think about where we are. There's no need to think realistically. So to get rid of the clouds, maybe we need to solve Nemo's problem? <laughs> oh no, therapy session. Well, what are you looking for, Mr. Nemo? We'll help you find it. My kids, you are really. <laughs> <laughs> That's so nice of you. Well, my kid's dead under there. <laughs> I've lost my name. I'm, oh I'm no, sorry, is what? this a freaking... I've lost my name finding Nemo. Your name? Hence Nemo. He oh, no, wait. Hence Nemo. Oh, wait, that was you. How do you lose your name? I just told you, Mr. Tinsilitis. Logical thought will get us nowhere. What does your name look like? Uh, I wonder what it does look like. I'll ask the questions here. Uh, uh, sorry, I'll ask the questions here, Bob. <laughs> I don't know, I can't see anything. Because your eyes are full of candle? Fucking obvious. No, no, that's not it. <laughs> because I don't have eyes, what oh. the fuck? <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, Pan's Labyrinth. I don't mistake. even have a mind. I don't even have <laughs> Pan's Labyrinth. I don't even have a mouth. <laughs> I ate the um, <laughs> oh, okay. When That's did Hans Christian Andersen fucking take over? <laughs> what? If a bird eats its own week, it will die, but if it eats its eyes, it will be fine. I don't think that's how it works. I don't know if I agree with if that one. It's its own beak. <laughs> I don't know. Geki? Is that a real thing? Are we dealing with a fucking serial killer? <laughs> <laughs> Every time S S Top Keki op here opens his mouth, he does terrible, terrible things to our Toto atmosphere. Everything he says is way too surreal. Yeah, not really. The carp is a long standing tradition in fairy tales, after all. Anyway, I think of her name falling into the mud here. Is it mud or caramel? Like, come on. Mm. It's poop. But we can't oh, see poop. anything through this caramel sauce. Do I just so happen to be carrying any convenient tools perfectly suited to the job? Um. Nageki, I have a pond fishing <laughs> set with me. How <laughs> fucking convenient. You keep one of those on your person? Doesn't your tummy ever get the rumblies that only a raw, raw pond smelt can cure? Ew. What? No. <laughs> no one up. ever understands me. Wah. Anyway, <laughs> maybe we can catch Mr. Nemo's name with this. Sure. Is this a mini game? <laughs> I don't know. No, I very much doubt it. <laughs> I've got something. I've got something. I've got a dragon! <laughs> oh, that's impressive, Mr. Tinsilitis. What is it? A dragon! Uh, hang on, I'll have it up in a second. <laughs> Look, an early Alice. A strawberry in the pudding. Mr. Nemo! <laughs> Your name is early Alice. Uh, I don't think it is. I'm pretty sure it's not it. Oh well. I guess there's nothing for it. Catch, release, and try again. <laughs> How many people have lost their names in this place? A bite! Okay. It's uh, like a it's, common problem. It's a big one. Yeah. It's certainly pulling it's quite, quite hard. A cool con it's quite a cool concept, like losing your name in a puddle. Yeah, that's kind of yeah. interesting. Yeah, let me Too bad the you. fucking bird game stole it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Please do. <laughs> we got it. Ta -da. <laughs> this is, uh... Everbearing Alexandria. <laughs> Mr. Nemo, Mr. Nemo, your name is Everbearing Alexandria. Fucking hope not. Oh uh, no. <laughs> and I'm not a strawberry. Beggars can't be choosers, Mr. Nemo. Jeez, how stubborn can you get? Very. Now, Gekki and I continue fishing for a while, but we only ever catch strawberries. Just what is Mr. Nemo's name? Is it strawberry? Oh, it probably is. You're probably right. I hope I'm wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it is your line. Oh, well, of course. I guess we're not finding it. Don't start feeling down, Mr. Strawberry Nemo. You'll make the rain <laughs> worse. <laughs> we might not find it at this rate. Maybe we should give you a new one. 
A new name for Mr. Nemo? Would that solve the problem? I haven't thought of it. I guess I'm empty from the room. It's back. <laughs> what? That's all we needed to do? A new name, a new name. If it's pudding, so help me God. How about Late Lucy? Early Rosie? No, I'd rather be dead. I told you, I'm not sure of her. On time, Trisha. <laughs> On time. Oh no! I got stuck in strawberry mode by accident. Um. <laughs> I can't think of anything. What about you, Nageki? You're leaving something that important to me? It's your idea, right? You can probably come up with a better one than I could anyway. Hmm. What about Hitori? No, <laughs> Hitori. Another song I like. Hitori? That's an odd name. I can't remember well, but I think uh, a long time ago when I was alive, someone very important to me was named Hitori. Are you sure you want to give me a name that precious to you? I don't mind that I can't remember anyway. You might as well have it. Hitori, Hitori, hmm. Hitori. Hmm. I am Hattori. Well, wow, I'm Hitler. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> yes, that's right. Thank you. Still covered in shit, though. I can't see you, but I can tell you that you are the most wonderful birds I've ever met. I'm, this. I'm not a bird. I wonder how I can thank you. Do I have anything? Oh, here. Let me give this to you. Please, take it. Oh, gemstone number three. Oh, we didn't get it from the king this time. Yeah. Where the hell was I keeping that? <laughs> yeah, I was like, ah, another pretty stone. <laughs> it's a topaz. I read that as tampax. <laughs> <laughs> it's very sunny and warm now. In Philadelphia. <laughs> I always have to take a nap in the forest when I feel like this. If only caramel Hitler, nay Nemo. Happily, uh, sorry, the Foley camera. I keep Oh my god! I keep saying Hitler. It's everything it's just right. reminds me of Hitler. Mary Nemo happily leaves the mountain. The rain has stopped. The king and the guardian deity won't have to worry about it now. The king is probably shaking and crying in his castle right about now. Let's go give him the good news.